2-1 victory tonight, hard fought win, uh, same outcome as Saturday in effect. Yeah, look, I thought, you said at the start of the season we'll need to be resilient, we'll need to, when we're having an off night, stick together, work hard for each other and tonight that's what it was. I, I did feel that we were off it with the ball, well, I thought out of possession, I thought we were tremendous. Um, but even saying that, I still think we had the better of the opportunities through, did, yeah. through, through the game. Um, I thought Sam Bailey for them was putting in dangerous crosses, but Coos and Sam, Niall and Cass, Finn just ate them up. And like I say, we knew we were going to have to stand up to that challenge. They're a direct team, they're good at what they do, um, they're getting around you. I felt whenever we played and really put our foot on the ball and, and showed composure, I felt that we we could get forward with it. Um, but it was, whether it was the last pass or the first pass, it was just seemed to be off it. And the times that we did, I felt that we, we could have gone ahead. Um, further, I think obviously in the first 10 15 minutes of the second half, I think we have two or three really good opportunities, and yeah. then um, you, you don't take them. And similar to what you say Saturday, they're always going to get that last opportunity. And lo and behold, I think the one time that we don't quite do our jobs in the box, they get a tapping at the back post. Um, but again, as I've said, they could have quite easily crumbled there and it could have finished 2 2, uh, but they stood up with the challenge and um, saw it out. And for me, it's the deserved three points. I thought we were. Off it in with possession, very good out of possession, but then, like I say, I, I still think we created better chances in, in the game. Uh, first half, Jim made a couple of good saves, uh, probably the only two he made in, in fairness. But uh, as you say, the chances kept coming, we squandered a few. Riggy gets the first, and then I think we all felt a, a bit of relief when uh, Dab got the second. Yeah, against look, against a decent team, they're going to have chances, they're going to have chances, we knew that. And, um, I wouldn't say they had clear-cut chances. I thought they had opportunities, but the boys defended it well. And um, like you say, Jim's made two or three good saves. We've had a couple of chances where I think their keepers tipped one over from Dav. How we saved it, I don't know. Um, we've had a couple that sort of scrambled around the box, things like that. So, look, it's for me, it's a, a result tonight that, as much as it, it's hard to watch for me because you know what I like with the team. I want them to play football, but it's a result for them tonight that shows that they can stand up and be counted because well, they could have quite easily rolled over there. It was definitely bodies on the line. It meant, it meant so much to them to get that three points, I think. Yeah, it did. And, and look, it's, I know we're, what, an hour, two hours away from each other. This is a derby for us and there's ex-Lancaster players, ex-working players. There's always going to be a little bit of needle in it and I, and I like that. I, I thought it was good. It was feisty. I thought there was decisions both ways that could have gone either way. Um, but overall, look, I'm delighted with the three points. And um, fingers crossed we can get the ball down and start moving it around again more comfortably like we did on Saturday. Um, but to stand up and be counted the way they did tonight was, was credit to the boys. Uh, well, 10 games in, I think, on Saturday. How do you think, what's your overall assessment so far? I mean, we've had a couple of sticky results, but uh, three three on the, on the bounce now, which uh, a good sign. Yeah, I probably I would probably put that down tonight. It's probably in possession our worst performance, and we've yeah. won the game. Yeah. We've played a lot better than that and lost the game, and that's the nature of the beast of this league. Um, I've heard three or four different managers say how good their season's been so far, and we're above them in the league. And look at it. Sometimes I think we haven't quite got going yet. I don't think. I don't think we're, we're starting to grow into the league. I think now, yeah. and look, that comes with its own pressure. And that's me. I'm not saying that we're going to go and win the league or be in the playoffs, but I think we're getting better and better every week. I think we're getting better out of possession. Um, but tonight, I think we're getting better in possession. And uh, like I say, this is this is through a major injury crisis. We've got many players out at the moment, and it's uh, obviously hasn't helped us tonight again. So. Look, we're thin on, the, thin on the ground again, as I said, Saturday. We will have to try and look to get a couple in. Um, and, and fingers crossed that comes in. It brings more competition. And boys want to work hard. I thought, again, I thought Niall Brookwell tonight was different class. I thought, well, I'd probably harsh to single out players, but I thought he was brilliant in there tonight. I thought it was his best game for us. And the back four all done really well. And, and like you say, the Tinners and Cass, you know what you get them from them guys. And then the front three. We just couldn't quite get them into the game enough for me, uh, but they all done their jobs really well at the top end of the pitch. Uh, you've probably seen most of the results tonight. It's a case of everybody taking points off each other. Yeah, that's this league. That's this league, and that, that's what I said. We'll go through. We're three on the bounce now with with wins and start of the season. What we won winning four or five. I've always said that the start of the season doesn't worry me. It's, we said last season, me and you stood out on that pitch after the Clitheroe game on Bank Holiday Monday and we were fourth bottom. It didn't, well, I wasn't worried. No. And, and I know for a fact that teams will take points off teams and you've just got to build momentum and, and that's what we're doing at the moment. We've, that's three on the bounce, so we won't get carried away. Um, we've now got a big, big game against FC here on Saturday. 
I'll have to make changes. I'll probably have to look at six, seven, eight changes on Saturday. It's, it's just the nature of the beast of, of at the age of our squad. Um, but fingers crossed we can get one, possibly two in before the weekend and give us a fresh bit of um, enthusiasm on the pitch. Danny, well done tonight. An excellent three points. Cheers, Steve. Thank you.